in taking this course, you ought to be able to write your own patent on your invention. Patents are important because what they do is they give you protection so that if you can, it gives you the opportunity to then go raise the funds and develop the product. And if you show that there's a market, you'll be able to um, turn that into a company without the big boys, if you like, stealing your idea from you. You know, we're, we're moving a lot more away from a manufacturing economy to really a um, um, uh, high-tech, innovative economy. And as we do that, um, we really need, innovation has to be protected, and where it's protected is in patents. Uh, a number of reasons why I created this course. Number one, of course, I do a lot of engineering, um, but also I've written over and participated in over 120 patents, uh, or patents pending, and I'm also a patent agent with the U.S. Patent and Trademark Office. Um, so, would like to share with the students a little bit about how to think about patents as a commercialization vehicle for either they want to start their own company or they're working in companies where they want to file patents on their inventions. I've uh, spun out five companies, uh, ranging all the way from angel back companies to venture back companies to government funded companies to patent holding companies. The America Invents Act is a law that was signed by President Obama and it goes fully into effect in March of 2013. It has a fundamental change to the patent system. The system as it exists today involves inventors getting the patent. So if you're the first inventor, then you're entitled to the patent even if you didn't file your patent application first. But under the American Invents Act, the first inventor to file his patent application or her patent application will get the patent even if they weren't the first inventor. So what that creates is sort of a race to the patent office. So our goals are a couple of things in mind. Uh, one is to make you a more educated uh, client if you are working with patent attorney, which most likely you will be, that you'll understand the process, understand what's being looked for to get you a better patent. Uh, the second thing is that you'll understand how to take your invention and figure out what's the point of novelty, what's new about it that's worth patenting. And the third is that if people are using your patent without giving you proper credit or proper financial reward, you know, what, what recourse do you have? We've had at least, people have written back to me, at least three of our students who took this course and then passed the patent bar exam. You know, what we're trying to do is we're trying to give the students who are Michigan engineering graduates a leg up on the competition.